Hi everyone, Akshaya here from Microsoft's 32 with Microcontrollers group. Today's digest is all about developing applications on the PIC32 CM GH family. These 32 bit microcontrollers featuring an ARM Cortex M0 Plus core provide a powerful functionality at a cost effective price. Whether you are managing automotive systems, functional safety applications, home appliances, industrial control, or developing applications with 5 volt requirements, the PIC32 CMGH is your solution. It is a cost effective addition to a SAM C2X family. It has 32 to 100 pin package options and has pin compatibility with SAM C2X devices in 32, 48, and 64 pin packages. It also enables application development requiring functional safety, enhanced touch capability, and security. It also enables application development using our rich software libraries, middleware, and application demos using MPLAB Harmony and MCC. It also supports CPU clock speeds up to 48 MHz and 512 KB flash and up to 64 KB SRAM with ECC. We have a variety of development boards like the PIC32 CMGH01 Curiosity Nano Plus Touch Evaluation Kit to get you started quickly. Check out the links in the description for more information. Jumpstart your development with the tools like MPLABX IDE, MPLAB Harmony, and MCC. Let's create an application on the PIC32 CMGH01 Curiosity Nano Plus Touch Evaluation Kit using Harmony and MCC. Open the MPLABX IDE. Go to the File menu and click on New Project. Provide PIC32 CM51640148 as the device name. Follow the on-screen instructions to complete the project creation. You can use Content Manager to download the packages for the peripherals and the middleware libraries that you need for the project. Use Project Graph to configure the peripherals for your application. Generate the project and build the application. Don't worry. We have a ton of resources available, including reference applications and tutorials to help you build amazing things. Head down to the description for links to get started with the PIC32CMGH family and unlock your potential for your next project. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more 32-bit MCU Digest.